NEO-283 is an upper Paleolithic woman from Kosha's Kulda Cave in the Caucasus. Radiocarbon dating places her somewhere between 26k to 25k years before present, which is before the last glacial maximum. She falls into a genetic cluster called the Dzudzwana Cluster, named after another cave in the Caucasus named Dzudzwana. Studies show that nearly every major population of Europe, the Near East, South and Central Asia, and even parts of Northeast Africa carries significant proportions of Dzudzwana ancestry. For this video, I gathered the raw DNA of NEO-283 from the European Nucleotide Archive, and analyzed its genome using my trait predictor and beta-calc tools. This sample is high quality, much better in quality than the sample from my previous Zudzwana video. According to QBDM analysis, this sample can be modeled as 74% West Eurasian proxied by the Epigravedians in this model and 26% Basal Eurasian proxied by Muti in this model. Her mitochondrial lineage is U4, which is rather common in Europe, Arabia, Caucasus, and Central Asia. According to G25, she is closest to Romani people, Turks, and Spaniards. With my trait predictor, she scores dark brown eyes, black hair, light brown or olive skin, wavy hair, and a Greek nose shape. She was predicted to be intermediate between the warrior and warrior phenotypes, to have higher D2 receptor density, to have high odds of autism, to be lactose intolerant, to have average empathy levels, higher odds of epithelial cancers, highest odds of autoimmune disease. In fact, this sample was homozygous for the HLA B27 alleles, which are associated with autoimmune disease. She carried no risk variants for colorblindness, had lower odds of obesity, and had blood type O. She was predicted to have high levels of vitamin D, average levels of LDL, average levels of HDL cholesterol, lower glucose levels, average hemoglobin levels, slightly higher blood pressure, slightly lowered levels of SHBG, slightly lowered levels of RBC, average telomere length, and slightly taller stature. With trait predictor, she scored particularly high for rheumatoid arthritis, epilepsy, leukemia, baldness, bipolar type 2, type 1 diabetes, and glioma. She scored particularly low for odds of erythema nodosum, gout, exfoliation glaucoma, Tourette's, cardiovascular issues, Alzheimer's, thyroid cancer, and polycythemia vera. She carried rare risk variants for Parkinson's, Jacob Creutzfeldt disease, congenital analgesia, and Hirschsprung disease. Moving on to her beta-calc results, she scored high for odds of bipolar disorder type 1, colorectal cancer, coronary artery disease, ovarian cancer, schizophrenia, and skin cancer. She scored low for odds of anxiety disorder, autism, esophageal cancer, hypertension, and stroke. You can purchase her genome from the link in the description. There, you will also find links to buy my tools and services.